Hi, this is Brandon from Android Device and Tutorials. Um, today we're going to take a look at this Galaxy Tab 3. And um, here I just wanted to do a short video on the initial setup. Um, when you get your tablet, you turn it on, this is the screen it'll come to. Okay, first you're going to select your um, language, which in our case is English. So we'll hit next. Okay, now it's on uh, Wi Fi. So now I want you to connect to a wireless network. So we'll go ahead and select this one. This is ours. And then we will type in the password. Uh, okay, and we will connect. I assume nobody's going to come to my house and try to connect to this, so <laughs> not really worried about it. <clears throat> okay, so now that we're connected, we can hit next. You can skip that step too if you don't have uh, Wi Fi wherever you are. Um, and now you have the date time and uh, time zone so here let me see what time it is here okay it's 605 here so we're gonna go ahead and change this 606 that works time zone we're in the eastern time zone okay we have to change that again so change time zone first uh, all right <clears throat> So once that's set, we'll just say set and next. All right, of course, if you want to read this, you can, but we never do. Um, uh, error data, yeah, we, we'll go ahead and send it. Okay, now here you can sign into your um, Samsung account. All right, we're going to skip this step just to avoid having to do it right now, but um, you could sign in here if you have a Samsung account or create a new one here if you want to create a new one. Just go ahead and say skip. All right, here you want to um, connect to your Google account. We do have one. We will say yes. And now I'm going to pull it out of here just to type this in real fast. Okay. Then we're going to get hit next. And you're going to get a privacy thing. Here we can go ahead and move this back in. Okay. Um, so keep me up to date with news and offers. No, we've done that multiple times. So we'll say okay. All right, now it's the backup and restore. You can uh, restore all of your purchases to this tablet. We don't want to do that right now. We'll we'll start it off fresh, and then keep this backed up with our Google account. And we bugged out, so we want it to be a fresh install. Now, um, locations. Yes, we'll let Google access all of our data. You don't have to. You can say. Um, uh, allow it to use your Wi-Fi for to find your location and also let Google Apps um, access the location so if you use any apps that require location that's where that is or what it's for and then we come up to a Dropbox we can actually um, sign into our Dropbox account um, and they will give you 50 gigs of drop uh, 50 more gigs in your Dropbox account um, for buying the tablet, which is a nice little addition. So we'll go ahead and sign into this. We'll pull it away again. Okay, now we logged into our Dropbox account. And now I can say save your photos automatically to Dropbox. We'll go ahead and turn that on. You don't have to if you don't want to. And we will allow this device. Okay, now there's some features on this tablet that you want to enable or disable. Um, one of them is voice control. Um, one of them is smart stay. The screen will stay on while you're looking at it. And one is the adapt display. Um, and it, I mean, none of these, you don't need to use any of these. You can set your screen time out for a certain amount of time or, you know, whatever. But right now, we'll, we'll leave it to default. Now the device name. Okay. Um, we always change this. Um, you don't have to. Um, let's see. We have a lot of things on our network, so we need to actually change the name. And that's it. You are now in your tablet, and you can use it freely. Um, do whatever you feel like you need to do. Um, 
now of course it's updating everything because we're connected to Wi-Fi so it's gonna add all of our um, it's gonna update any of the apps that are already on it because we did tell it not to bring in the new apps um, but that's it so you are set once you get through that whole process you can now use your tablet um, go to the the Play Store download things whatever um, so I hope that helps um, anyway so thanks for watching